All right, let's unpause in five, four, three, two, one. Unpause. 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. And we have Grenadiers crossing the lake, which is brand new Sorry. to Samoski play. We have a little skirmish in the south. We're over the fuel point. Pioneers versus engineers. They're going to hop in the house. Soviets will move away. It's very crucial, that house. Yeah, it is. And they're not going to even try to cap. They're going to move on. A similar skirmish in the north by the fuel, but these conscripts will overpower the pioneers. Unless they hop in the house. There's only two left, though. That's not good. So, Hansi, you, you weren't able to play in this weekend's tournament. No, unfortunately, I wasn't able to because there was a festival going on in my uh, home city of Brighton. So, I, want, uh, I prefer to attend that, unfortunately. <laughs> right on. Did you see some bands? Yeah, I saw some uh, Japanese uh, uh, bands from uh, from all over the world, actually. They, they like just to play the music from Japan, so it was pretty good. Cool, cool. New cool, music cool. and stuff that I haven't heard before. I'm glad that freed you up uh, to co-cast with me a few games here. Got two Grands moving into the center. Um, these engineers from Condemnation Wings are putting up Tier 1, so let's see what he chooses to build. He's got an M3 on the way. Is he going to upgrade a flamer as well alongside that? Yes, he is. Well predicted. He is. All right. They're upgrading. Oh, so I'd just like to point out the fact that you said there's no blizzards, right? Yeah. How is the ice going to repair itself? That's going to be interesting to see. <laughs> I, I, good question. I don't know. Does it really take a blizzard for the ice to repair? I thought it kind of just did it on its own. I think it needs a blizzard. I'm not entirely sure, but I believe it's Me a blizzard. <laughs> That's funny. We don't know, and we've played, you know, so many games and watched so many games. <laughs> Maybe Tribal Bob can tell us. He probably doesn't know either. Uh, yeah, he probably... Uh, sorry, 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 Bob. <laughs> the troll Tribal Bob. He doesn't care. He's, he's a good sport. Right? Don't, don't get mad at me. I love watching the units cross the lake. Okay, sorry, I've been n not following this M3. We need to keep an eye on him. He is oh, the shock go. unit. Uh, there's going to be a sniper and coming behind him. Oh, is that? He's got a flamer inside the half track. Those Grens, got to be careful. It looks like he's going to focus the three-man Gren squad by the fuel point here. Oh. Oh, two man. Oh, we might kill it on retreat. I think he's going to get it. I thought he would too, but oh, why isn't he giving chase? What a what, what a lucky grin! Look at him. Chase? Look at him. Oh, no. Up to his knees in snow, getting through this heavy heavy area. Yeah, he he could have gotten the kill with a little bit better micro. That's a shame. That could have been an early kill. That's nice. He, he sort of pushes in a bit, tries to draw like the animation or tries to get a, get a kill before the Faust is able to come off. And then he backs right out of there. Yeah. Have you Some been watching? Decent kite and go along here. Have you been watching uh, HQ Condemnation? This guy is a beast. There's a kill. No, I actually haven't been. I've never played against him yet. I want to, actually. I know, I've seen, I know that he's won the last Langras tournament, but I've actually never. Uh, played him in an uh, auto match, and I would like to challenge him. If he's watching, I would want to play you. All right, I like that. Soon, yeah, let's get it up going on, man. Show match. Show matches on on what Thursday? Show match Fridays. Fridays a good day for show matches. Yeah, let's do it. Let's look it up. Oh, we lost a pi uh, German uh, apple stuff. Just lost a pioneer on the right hand side to a conscript squad. Yes, he did. Where is their body? Buried in snow. We've got a flank coming in by the M3 against the MG. And the MG Friends takes so much more damage now. 
He's going to retreat and save that unit. So Applesoft played an amazing series against um, my clanmate, Northwest Fresh Reborn. We cast that earlier today. Game one is epic. If you didn't see it, I suggest you check YouTube tomorrow. We'll, we'll have the VOD up. Applesoft first, Northwest Fresh. Just an excellent game. Just comebacks, swings. You know, it's, it was one of these co-games that wasn't perfectly played, but that made it more interesting and more exciting because the swings were so drastic and you could never tell who was ahead or who was going to win. It's a really exciting game one. Game two is pretty good, too. Yeah. We'll check that out. So, uh, Captain Obvious just lost his M3 and now he's been pushed back by this scout car. Looks like some guards have just made it to the field. Yep. We have uh, Condemnation selecting a Doctrine that involves, at the end, the ISU-152. And I haven't seen him build that unit since the tournament. But I remember in the tournament, I think he built it twice in very important, important games. That's Shock Motor Heavy, the name of that doctrine, the Shock Motor Heavy Doctrine, or Heavy Tactics, or something like that. So it would be super cool if we saw the ISC-152 <laughs> if this game goes that deep. I don't know if it will. Yeah. Brain squad on the left that might go down here to a conscript squad. He's oh, like, oh, he dies. He lost a second unit. That's the second time. Uh, you know, he's he's lost a unit at each VP on the, uh, once on the left and once on the right. Now, Applesoft might be a little nervous. I don't know if he's ever faced somebody like Condemnation. He is the number one seed, so he comes. You know, he's a bit intimidating to load in against him. Be more better at preserving his units though. If he keeps on up by like this, he's gonna have a hard time. And now he loses a scout car. Oh, how he's in real trouble now. He is. He's just retreating the MG in advance of being flanked. One harassing set of Panzer Grenadiers going over to the right. But other than that, it's all condemnation, capping, putting some mines down. He's retreating some NGs. It's time to... We have a half-track being built. Time to go to the next tier. Let's see. The second is the passive anti-tank anti gun ambush tactics. That's something you don't often see used. Mm. All right. The TZGs fend off against conscripts, so they're going to continue capping. It's really important that Applesoft is able to get out of his base. You can't, you can't let your enemy control the area around this entrance. Well, maybe on Semwa Winter it's different, you know, because you can go across the lake, so. Yeah. Oh, a nice grenade there. Grenade scored down to two man. Sniper's still picking away at them. We do see a half track by Applesoft, but he's not upgraded to a flamer yet. Oh, he's doing it now. He's upgrading it now, so we shall see a flamer half track fairly soon. All right, well, how would you deal with these guards? I mean, if you're a Wehrmacht, you're primarily a Wehrmacht player, so you just upgraded your Flamer half-track. Yeah. You know that guards just kept that point. Do you avoid them? Do you attack them? Do you try to work elsewhere? What's your plan? Well, I try to go and attack. I would try and attack them head-on and trying to get them off the field, because if I can get them off the field and then quickly repair my half-track, I can literally dominate the entire battlefield if I can just get rid of the guard squad. I mean, guard squads are not that strong on their own. What you've got to worry about is a guard squad, along with a conscript squad with an AT grenade ability. That's a problem for a flamer half track. But a guard squad on its own is not such a big deal. Crazy retreat path from these well, Panzer Grenadiers. They had to um, slowly climb through this heavy snow before they were able to retreat on the back route, an avenue that's not normally open in Samoski, but is open in Samoski winter. All right, well, now we're seeing oh, exactly no. what you said we, he should be afraid of, and that is the combination of conscripts and guards. So the 18-8 is in. This half-track is already below half health, and he, why didn't he chase with the guards, though? Why didn't Condemnation yeah, chase? I would have done that. I would have tried and chased with the guards. He, he, two uh, volleys of uh, the guards' rifles then, you probably would have killed that half-track, I think. Alright, Applesoft has to organize some repairs. Now, chase, now running in with conscripts. Ooh, they don't get the nade off. 
I mean, 18 aids do a lot, but I don't think they could have killed it with its current health with one 18 aid. These guys urod to get into the church. Where are Apple Oh, I like that. Uh, Any grenade. Hey, on the right. Got to be careful with these guards, though. They might oh no! Down. They're dropping weapons. He got the. Pe he got his weapon back, and now he's going to try to retreat right through the fire of those Panzer Grenadiers. But he will get a nice break. Let's see if he's going to go by these Grenadiers. <laughs> I, be I believe Applesoft just lost a eunuch because the. The voiceover guy just said they lost something. I'm not sure what they lost, though. I'm not sure either. I missed Pioneer it. Squad? His action in the center. He can't afford to lose Pios. He, he really needs to repair this half track. Oh, double back Grenadier might go down here. Near the fuel point. Oh, he gets out of there. I want Alphasoft to show no. us his A game. I mean, this is the first game of the day, so they both should be well rested. Um, no excuses for either of them. And we need Alphasoft to, to push this deep so that we see some some heavy tanks. Have you selected a commander yet? No, he hasn't se uh, selected a commander yet. But I have noticed that he's going very heavy Panzer Grenadiers. He's got three squads of Panzer Grenadiers now. He's just rebuilt a Pioneer squad, so I'm guessing he wants to repair his uh, half track. Yes, they need to get to work because the Su-85 has just come on the field, and I guarantee you he is going to go. Half track hunting. Mm -hmm. Now the fact that he's he he's gone pans grand is is probably not a great idea, especially when uh, Captain Obvious has got a sniper out, because a couple of sniper teams would would be the perfect counter to a Panzer Grenadier spam. So I'm not sure why he's done that. Yeah, this one sniper of Condemnation has eight kills. These lovely ladies of Company of Heroes 2. Do you think, do you think they'll complain if I spam Just spam click on them? You want the sniper? Probably. They, I think every Comrade? complains if you click on them enough. Okay. okay, so Applesoft knows he's got an SU-85 out. He's just taking a yeah. shot at that. Peach. All right, well, the, the half-track is over here. Uh, he's Look at that. Double vet on those conscripts laying in the 18-8. Oh, I was wondering if he would try to cut across the lake to go after this half-track. And oh, sure yes. enough, here it comes. Now, this is dangerous, though. I mean, some kind of crazy nade or something could dunk this tank in the lake. So it's a bit risky. Wow, see, even the t ice takes damage from the splash of that Faust. Ooh, conversely, we could see this Grenadier's uh, nade uh, squad. We dunked. just lost a Panzer Grenadier. Where? I think in the south, there's a couple of Panzer Grenadier bodies in the south. I think he just lost it to the guard squad there. Uh, oh, man. He's that's having a, a tough that's like his time. fourth unit he's now lost. Yeah, he's really having a tough time preserving his units. And it's showing in the map control and these snipers you know every time the the grenadiers or panzer grenadiers oh, rifle grenade yeah nice try but hq condemnation wings man he's too good for that he uh, microed away now he's starting to pick off members of the mg team he's he's so quick he man look he's uh, already Apple's repaired for to waste these munitions yeah he's already repaired the crit on the su85 this guy is tough man i'm glad that uh we put him at the number one seed. I think OMG Pop had the highest actual combined rank. We averaged all the ranks to allow us to seed most of the players. And uh, we bumped Condemnation up number one because, of course, winning a tournament means much more than your ladder performances. Panzer Grenadier Scott might go down in the center. He's running in Ouch. carelessly. Oh, he really is. Retreating? That is a Oh, Applesoft, <laughs> he's getting really worked over. Oh my god, oh, oh, like, what he, in the heck? I guess he was looking over that here, was but he lost both Panzer Grenadiers. Okay, I'm about ready to, you know, call GG on this and go to the next replay. Yeah.
This I'm is... pretty shocked by Applesoft's play. He's lost way too many units, and he's in the quarterfinals. I don't want to be offensive, but I'm pretty surprised. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. He still has an opportunity to perhaps prove himself in the next game. He does have tournament experience. He's gotten quite deep in uh, various events in Germany, maybe HQCOH tournaments or ESL tournaments. I've seen him name at the end of bracket trees. Uh-oh. Doesn't want to walk into this. Oh, half track. Better turn around quick yeah. before the issue out. Yeah, up. he started spitting, but he doesn't see the half track. He, he could pop his spotting scope. I don't know if he has any idea that that thing's out there. The game looks so different with Fog of War on. Okay, this is what he sees coming. Okay, he did pop the spotting scope and reveals those infantry. Panzergren, uh, I'm sorry, Grenadiers just uh, stole a DPR, I think. Mm -hmm. Just look at the map, it's just all red for me. Yeah, and all blue for all of us. A few depot, a few, a fuel cache, two fuel caches plopped down by HQ Condemnation Wings. I feel like this is just a matter of time that we're, we're sort of yeah. watching a ghost. Like he's already dead, I feel. Pretty much. I don't think he's going to come back from this off. Uh, losing about seven units, eight units yeah. by now. I don't think, and the only thing Captain Obvious has lost is one M3 half track, and I think you, that was it. You keep saying Captain Obvious. Of course, you mean Condemnation Wings. Captain Obvious got pretty far in the, in the tournament. It. No, it's fine. It's no problem. It's really hard to keep the players' names straight. I've miscalled them millions of times. Cap Condemnation but Wings. Captain Obvious, Julie noted. he got really far. We, I casted a few of his games yesterday. I can't. I forget who took him out. I think it might have been Barton, actually. So uh, Applesauce has recruited himself a more half track, but I don't see how that's going to combat the issue 85s. Yeah, plural now. I want to see a really good game on Samoski Winter. I want to see bashed up ice. I want to see flames and you know incendiary uh, barrages against units on the ice. I want to see guys get dunked. I want to see a broom bear, Panthers, ISU 152. I am drooling for potential of great games. Our next series will be Barton versus Cannonball. That should be fun. Oh yeah. Oh, look, some snipers being very ballsy here, running right up into these Panzer Grenadiers on the ice. Yeah, blitzing to forward. Get kill shot. <laughs> you don't often see snipers run. Oh, and they get it. They it, got it. Into path. Amazing. He is just completely in rhythm right now. Just getting everything he wants, having his way. I really like that move with the snipers. That was ballsy, risky, and it paid off. Now they're shooting this MG team in the back of the head. Yeah, it's like 100%, almost 100% of the time you see this sprint popped to run away from uh, attacking infantry, but he actually popped sprint to run toward the enemy and annihilate that retreating squad. It's only 10 munitions, so it's really spammable. He's going to do it again here against this There MG. he goes! Look I at love this! this. Come on, shoot! Oh, oh, maybe. oh uh, what's up? They didn't shoot. I was, ready to, I was ready to give the fist pump. Whoa, they got to be careful. They're getting mortared over the ad. Okay. She's going to go home and recruit another sister. Mortars don't discriminate. There she is. Oh, I got I to gotta put on my Ushanka later. Then I'd really start to sweat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's just popped a uh, an ability. What is it, Ami? This is the Axis Space Precision Bombing. All right.
right? He did well, a lot of damage to that bunker. MG-ness. Yeah. Man, Condemnation Wing's just having fun now. Yeah. So at this point, Condemnation just needs to build like Katusha's, or what he's just brought onto the field now is... The ISU-1552. That has a nice ring to it. The ISU-152. You know, Hansi, I actually got to see one of these in the flesh recently in Berlin. Really they, nice. There is an ISU-152 at a museum in Karlshorst. And I took my son out there for a bike ride, and they had everything, man. SU-100, Katusha, IS-2, a couple of T-34s, anti-tank guns. It was just amazing to see these tanks up close and personal. And this, the, you know, the ISU-152, it's just chunky, you know? I mean, look at the front end of that thing. <laughs> it's just massive. All right, well, he's got insane range. So the base attack is on. Look at the Russian armor is boldly pushing forward across the ice. He's got to be careful. Pack shooting at him. One couple. Yeah, we could see a tank get dunked. Ooh, look at that. Long range from the ISU kills the half track. His shot went sailing across my screen. Here we can see the water has opened up a bit. We have a little crit. Oh, uh, nice ability. Oh, that was target, target weak point from the pack. Okay. Oh, one oh, SU-85 five falls. Down. Triple that on these grands, but they have to retreat. And still the ISU the is just... has been completely yeah. destroyed. The ISU at range just plucked him from all the way across the lake. All right, well, Condemnation gave me what I wanted. I wanted to see an ISU-152, not necessarily in this kind of mauling. He's mauled a lot of players in this tournament. But uh, it's still great to see this unit attacking across across the lake. If he can get eyes on the base. Whoa. Sneaky. <laughs> what are you doing, bro? What's this sneaky half-track up to? Maybe he's looking for the snipers. <laughs> yeah, there's yeah, also there's a German, German sniper as well right, down there. Just wandering about. Alright, well here are the lovely ladies. It would be a, a small moral victory for Applesoft to pick these girls off with their 22 kills. Oh no, that ISU-152 is on the ice. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the thing, could you imagine driving something like that on the ice? It would fall right in. I'm sure it's super heavy. Yeah. Whoa, but look at the splash against the Grens. This is brutal. Man, Applesoft might actually Come kill on, a second get it. SU-85. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, Wehrmacht fanboy. Down to 10 points. He's okay, there's some... What is this now? What's happening here? We'll just have to wait and see. He is... Oh, check out the Top Gunner shooting at the plane. Run. So cool. I didn't know that the top gunner of an ISU fires at airplanes. Look at him. He's trying look at him shoot at that airplane. Okay, we see the shadow of the plane still flying around, around but this game's going to end. There it goes firing it again. I'd love to see a plane crash to top it all off. Okay, no such luck, but another mauling by Condemnation Wings of his next victim. Opfelsoft, that's 1-0. That's um, we're going to go to the slideshow real quick, and we will be right back at you with Game 2. Stick with us, and see you soon.